السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ دس از رو سہیل اینڈ یو آر واشنگ ارکان ٹائمس ڈیلی انگلش نیوز ٹوڈے از مانڈے تھرٹی سپٹمبر ٹوئنٹی ٹوئنٹی فور نیوز ہیڈ لائنس Teenage Rohingya males among those sent back from Taknaf to Mongdo abducted by Arkan Army AA. Rohingya youth forcibly recruited by Arkan Army AA escaped. Details of today's news. Out of over 200 Rohingya who had fled to Bangladesh from escalating violence in Mongdo township, Arkan state, in the past three months, all teenage males were reportedly abducted by the Arkan Army AA after being returned from Taknaf district, Bangladesh on September 24. According to reports, in the early hours of September 24, starting around 1 a.m., the Bangladesh Border Guard BGP conducted a joint operation in Taknaf district targeting Rohingya refugees renting houses in the area. More than 200 Rohingya were arrested later in the afternoon of September 25, this Rohingya, including women, children, men, and the elderly, were sent back to Mongdo, specifically to the Yeu and Mongni villages under Arkan Army AA control. A family member of a Rohingya woman among those sent back said that all teenage Rohingya males were taken away by Arkan Army AA forces shortly after their return. They were sent back to the Yeu and Mongni villages. Since this, our Arkan Army AA controlled area, only Arkan Army AA members are present. Arkan Army AA members arrived and took away all the teenage males. We don't know where they were taken. Our phones were confiscated and we have lost all contact. We don't know if they are dead or alive. The women and children were left in the deserted villages without food. They fled to Bangladesh to escape the terror and violence caused by the military and Arkan Army AA. But the Bangladesh government shout no mercy, returning them to the hellish Mongdo, which feels like sending them to death, the family members said. Approximately 20,000 Rohingya Muslims have fled to Bangladesh in the past three months due to the rising violence in Arkana State. Many of these refugees are not staying in UNHCR-run refugee camp, but in state renting houses near the Mema border in Taknav district, according to Bangladeshi officials. Bangladeshi officials have stated that the country is no longer in a position to offer further refuse to the Rohingya, saying it is impossible to fully seal the border, but we must take a step to prevent further illegal entry. The interim government's chief advisor, Dr. Muhammad Yunus, emphasized the need to address this issue. Several Rohingya youths who were forcibly recruited by the Arkan Army AA from various villages and towns escaped from an Arkan Army AA base camp during the last week of September, specifically on September 24. The Arkan Army AA has been forcibly recruiting numerous Rohingya youths from different villages, subjecting them to military training and then sending them to the front line. During their training, the recruited youths were intimidated, tortured, and subjected to various forms of mistreatment and persecutions. Some of the forcibly recruited Rohingya youths were assigned duties at a hospital in Balukali hamlet Zimbanya village in Mongdo. After staying there for a few days, they managed to escape. They were assigned to the hospital in Balukali hamlet Zimbanya village for duty, which they performed for a few days before escaping. However, they did not take any ammunition with them. They left all their weapons and ammunition at the hospital and fled with only their lives, taking nothing else with them, a source explained. A resident shared, they escaped because they were mistreated, they were not provided food on time. We are not allowed to pray and we are not allowed to communicate with their families or fellow villagers. They were simply used on the front line in, a, in any situation without being paid any stipends or salaries. According to a source, after the youths escaped from the hospital, the Arkan Army AA conducted widespread searches and retaliated against ordinary Rohingyas in the area, intimidating them in villages across Mongdo. The Arkan Army AA reportedly told ordinary Rohingya villagers the escaped Muslim members of the Arkan Army AA from the hospital in Balukali hamlet Zimbia village must be found wherever they are. If not, the villagers will face mistreatment in their place. There are many more forcibly recruited Rohingya youths in the hands of the Arkan Army AA, and they continue to face mistreatment and discrimination due to their identity as Muslims. Unlike the Rakhines, the Rohingya are not given any facilities, all the benefits are reserved for the Rakhines. 
The Rohingyas are being used as a daily laborers there.